Hello Aries, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Aries, this is your reading for the month of uh, September 2021 and this is a general reading. Take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid, okay? Also Aries, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below if you find yourself getting resonated with this reading. I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. Aries, what I'm going to do in this reading is I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent your energy. Then I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with. In between, I'm going to place a couple of cards and they will represent the mutual energy between you and your person. Okay, right. So let's get started now. Aries, let's get started. So we have is a nine of pentacles for you. Then we have is hierophant. We have is three of pentacles. Interesting. We have is five of cups. We have lovers and we have knight of pentacles. We have devil and we have is a three of wands. So Aries, you may be dealing with a Gemini. You may be dealing with a Capricorn. You may be dealing with a Taurus. Taurus Virgo Capricorn is standing out. You may be dealing with Aries Leo Sag as well and as well as Pisces Cancer Scorpio. If the sign pops up, all the better. Let's not remain fixed on the signs. Okay, are you able to see the cards? I hope so. Okay, so... Uh, also, you may be seeing a lot of 666, you may be seeing a lot of 333, 555, okay? Okay, so we have is 9 of pentacles, we have hair fint, and we have is 3 of pentacles, Aries. <laughs> it's a very clear-cut indication, Aries, that you are not going to remain single for long, okay? And not just single... I mean, not just uh, a relationship is going to happen for you, but I see that a relationship from a long-term perspective or a relationship which will culminate into marriage, which will get converted into marriage is going to happen for you. Look, it's a very strong indication, Aries. With a Hierophant and with that Three of Pentacles, it's a strong indication of marriage and a long-term commitment. Building something from a long-term perspective. Okay, Hierophant represents commitment. Hierophant also represents authority. And we have Nine of Pentacles and we have Hierophant next to Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles represents us uh, being single. But with Hierophant next to Nine of Pentacles, ah, ooh la la, okay. Please expect someone entering in your life and whosoever is going to enter in your life, they are entering in your life from a long-term perspective or, or from marriage. And we also have a second uh, confirmation. Three of Pentacles is just validating Hierophant, okay? It's like, yes, it's done, signed, stamped and sealed. It's sort of a feeling I'm getting over here. <laughs> Okay, so I'm happy. This is this is a very strong, uh, this spread, this three card spread is very strong, Aries. And it's a very, uh, you know, the cards are leading to next event consequently. It's like being single, then getting married. Then it's like having a long-term partnership with kids and family and building something big from long-term perspective. Okay, the cards are very sequential. So I'm very happy. Okay, so who will be this person, Aries? Huh? Who is this person who you're going to marry? Most likely I'm feeling that this is going to be a new person. But because we have devil card and we also have lovers in your person spread, we also have five of cups, it can be a past person as well. Let's not deny that. Okay, so let let me pull out this uh, some clarifiers for Hierophant. Please give me some clarifiers for Hierophant. Tell me who is this person? We have a two of wands. Someone who is waiting for you. Yeah, yeah. Six of cups. We have two of wands. We have a five of swords. We have a six of cups. Okay. Probably a past person, some of you. For some of you, a past life soulmate. 
or a twin flame okay a person who sort of uh, sort of was nasty uh, in the past okay or for some of you uh, it can also be a past life soulmate okay but with that hierophant card very honestly and with that nine of pentacles with the kind of energy you are um, uh, you are throwing out with the kind of energy you are emanating right now somehow i'm sensing that aries you are going to attract a new person and whosoever wants a past person you are manifesting that past person okay otherwise universe is sending you a new person and this new person is very passionate someone with an authority someone uh, who has a lot of respect within the community someone who is good with the money okay so congratulations i'm i'm very i'm very very happy for you guys five of cups lovers and knight of pentacles someone is sad missing you someone cannot someone cannot forget you someone had opportunities with other people as well but still they cannot forget you why why they cannot forget you because there is so much of love okay there is so much of love this person is thinking constantly like why this relationship happened why they are not able to forget you in spite of making efforts why 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 it's like they there is a constant struggle with the why okay so this person is coming to the terms they are accepting and they are realizing that they absolutely love you aries this person loves you okay they are having some strong realizations okay those those realizations are like a is like a big jolt and a big bolt to them okay so for some of you yes it's a strong indication of a past life soulmate okay someone from the past life someone with whom uh, someone who was your partner who was your lover in the past life is uh, coming back in this lifetime as well uh, i am getting an indication of twin flame relationship and let me tell you that twin flame relationships are very intense okay so with a knight of pentacles your person intends to come towards you slow and steady they are like slow and steady once there is they are trying to tap on your energy okay they are trying to tap on your energy they are trying to understand what are you feeling uh what do you think about them probably this person has an energetic hold on you even as of now aries okay so right we have devil we have is three of wands someone had choices and someone has made a decision okay someone was feeling quite obsessive and probably uh there was a situation which was quite toxic and based on the toxicity you have made the decisions now okay so there was a situation which was very toxic i'm just sorry i'm trying to adjust the camera okay there was a situation which was very toxic in the past but now Uh, some decisions have been made someone had choices it can also be you it can also be them okay so some clear cut choices have been made i'm so happy for you aries i'm very happy this is a very positive spread okay and by the way yes your person is thinking quite obsessively about you this person is going crazy and especially they are going crazy because they are thinking that you are attracting new suitors for yourself there are new people who are interested in you and they want to stop you they want to stop you okay they they look uh if this was a toxic situation then definitely the ball is in your court okay you can take a call what you want to do whether you want to entertain this person or whether you don't want to entertain this person because i'm getting a strong energy that someone wants to chain you down this is not for all of you but for some of your For, but for some of you your past partners they are a bit stuck a bit they are a bit toxic even as of now and they want to do something to chain you down they don't want you to move on in your life they just want you to remain stuck okay so just be aware of this energy and aries i'm getting an energy that there is some travel that is about to happen for work reasons or maybe are you planning to purchase some property or a car that's the energy i'm getting over here yeah you're planning to buy a car or maybe some property or you're trying to save your money for some future investments hmm i also see that you may want to do something that you really love from the bottom of your heart 
whatever you're doing right now it's not that you don't love okay i'm talking from career and your professional perspective it's not that you don't love but you're trying to understand yourself okay is this you're trying to do future analysis so you are like you know do i see myself doing this for next 10 years do i see myself doing whatever i am doing right now for next 20 years okay where do i want to reach for next 10 years where do i want to reach for next 20 years okay what can, what i want to see what i want uh myself to do in next 10 years 5 years 20 years okay so you are trying to imagine yourself in the future period okay and then probably considering that you are trying to make certain changes or you want to make certain changes in your career or in your profession some of you may want to make a switch some of you are like no i want to do something on my own sitting at my home i want to do okay so maybe some of you are planning to make a switch to youtube okay you are changing careers is what i'm sensing money is anyway looking good for you aries money is looking good for you okay your new partner is also uh, good with money but you are also very good with money okay all right i hope this resonates hit like share and subscribe and comment down below till then bye bye aries